One of the most important things uh, to me as a gastroenterologist is prevention and treatment of colon cancer. Colon cancer is preventable, treatable, and beatable. Colorectal cancer is the third leading cause of cancer deaths in the United States. There are approximately 150,000 new cases of colorectal cancer diagnosed in the United States each year, and 50,000 people die from this disease. We can save at least 30,000 lives each year with increased awareness and screening programs. Colonoscopy is the best screening test for colorectal cancer as it can not only find colon cancer, but it gives us the ability to find the precancerous growths and remove them before they get a chance to turn into cancer. All colon cancers begin as polyps, which are abnormal precancerous growths that are bumps that grow off the inner lining of the wall of the colon. The biggest risk factor for developing polyps is simply being over the age of 50, which is why colonoscopy is recommended to all individuals over the age of 50. We remove polyps in many different ways, and we pass various instruments through the colonoscope, such as biopsy forceps or snares, which are wire loops. Polyps come in all different shapes, sizes, and in many different locations of the colon. There are times when we encounter a very large polyp or a polyp in an anatomically difficult area, such as behind a fold, where attempted removal will increase the risk of bowel perforation. And many times patients are actually referred to surgeons for an operation to remove a large part of their colon in order to remove the precancerous polyp. It's important to remove these benign appearing polyps as it is estimated that the risk of cancer in these large polyps can be as high as 15%. Cells allows us to go to the next level. What, what it allows me to do is through two tiny, small, five millimeter incisions, I can access the intra-abdominal compartment. I can manipulate the bowel to allow for my colleague to have better visualization of the large polyp or better visualization of the polyp that's sort of tucked behind a fold. Doing cells allows us to avoid having to remove a segment of the colon. For our patients, I mean, they have faster recovery. Uh, they leave the hospital the same day as opposed to a colon resection where they leave on average three to five days later. Uh, our patients are going home the same day and they're back to work in two days. The cells procedure in a carefully selected patient can be performed safely with minimal morbidity and favorable outcomes. And cells is just one of the many innovations taking place at Riverview Medical Center.